So this is a chain stitch for the uh, trawl cot end. Um, you're going to want to make sure the uh, cot end rope is uh, about even, both sides. Uh, make sure the uh, liner isn't caught in between any of the rings, so you get a nice tight <clears throat> uh, cinch on it with the rings. Take two ends, come around, make an overhand knot with a bite, cinch that down good and tight. Uh, with the end without the loop in it, comes up through the bite. Cinch that down. Again, the end without the loop comes up through the bite. Cinch that down. And just keep repeating. And you should put, I don't know, five or six of these in at least. Um, if you want, uh, you can run the last, uh, the last one through the loop like that, and then cinch that down. That'll actually lock it in place, but it'll make it harder to get out. Usually, we don't, we don't bother with that. Just, uh, just keep making the loop and let it go. That's usually fine. Um, you can see it. This is how it looks. And then when you undo it, uh, you're just gonna put some weight on the on the net, pull on one end, pull on the other end, and it should just keep popping out. Assuming you can yank on it.